Welcome to probably the earliest I'm ever gonna do Luigi's Mansion 2. <laughs> I'm doing this at like, before even 8 in the morning. So, I decided to go to bed at like, really early last night. I found like a new strategy <laughs> for getting some extra sleep. And it turns out, if I like, you know, start watching YouTube at like 10 p.m., and I just like close my eyes for a while, I can like sleep and watch YouTube at the same time. <laughs> get that done, and then I can get some extra sleep in, and then I can go to bed early. And then I woke up, I woke up at like 6.30 this morning, which was great. So I actually get to be up nice and early today. Anyways, I don't know if we're gonna beat the Treacherous Mansion today. Probably not. I think it's gonna be a pretty long one. So we can do it like half of it today, probably. Oh, that's not good. That's not good at all. The paranormal readings in the Treacherous Mansion are getting stronger. With the periscope going bonkers like this, there's no way it'll be able to find the Dark Moon piece. I'm also worried about the safety of my toad assistant. How many frickin' toad assistants you have, man? <laughs> See, the mansion contains exhibits full of artifacts from all over beyond the ever shady valley. They're very valuable, so I sent a toad creator look after them. But looking at these readings, I reckon he may be in a hostile work environment. We need to help him. Oh, yeah, they're, vo they're already violating the, the product of workplace safety. <laughs> He has four toad assistants, they all suck. Wow. Good job, Egad. More like Elgad, because he can't do anything, right? You might know where the ghosts are hiding in the Dark Moon piece. Okay, don't drop the front door key this time, youngster. Off you go. Imagine, like, half the missions, Luigi just drops the key and he has to go get it, and then, like, you get, like, maybe one room done. Hello, chat member. Uh, we're playing with Flying Luigi today, which, uh, looks dapper as hell. I kind of forgot I threw on a new, um, skin. I, I try to throw on a new skin every episode, though. There's a bunch of other ones I haven't shown off yet, like, um, I think there's a Scarescraper skin I haven't seen yet. There's also a Gooigi skin, a Mr. L skin. We might use the Mr. L skin for the finale, honestly. Well, by finale, I mean the episode that I fight King Boo, because there's probably gotta be some other episodes where I have to, um, get all the gems that I missed, because that's gonna be a, an episode per gem, probably. Okie dokie. <laughs> Okie dokie. Man, every time I come back to this game, it's just nice to hear, uh, Charles as Luigi again. Ooh. Yeah, definitely definitely nothing strange there. I am half asleep, so my commentary might be shit. I might be really bad at the puzzles, but here we are anyways. Oh wow, we have uh, the portals from earlier. That's pretty cool. Thanks, Gargoyle. It's like Gargoyle's quest. I don't know if I'm supposed to do anything with this carpet or not. Huh. Weird, okay. I don't know, usually these carpets are for, um... Like, slipping off the armor. If there's one thing I'm aware about this game, it is the final boss. <laughs> I do I do find that pretty unforgettable. <laughs> An unforgettable luncheon. Hey buddy, you wanna give me that bucket on your head? I haven't played this game in a little bit. And I mean that's mostly because I've been playing Mario Luigi Brothership. <laughs> I beat that game in a couple of weeks. <laughs> Alright, get over here. The music in this game is great. Ah, oh, god damn it, bro. Here, come here. We're gonna absolutely suck at catching ghosts this episode. Boom. 
Hello, anybody in here? Wait, there's another goon over there? How many goons are there, man? There's so many of you guys. Just gotta, just gotta catch him before uh, those guys throw shit at me. Like that. Alright, where'd you go, buddy? Oh, there you are. We got strong guys. That's how they, that's how they make the combat more interesting. I mean, it's not bad. Eh, eh. I'll just use the, uh, dark light on everything. Oh. Oh, look at that. There's a frickin' book right here. That does something for me. I got the, the painting, the portal. I'm playing Portal 2, Mario. And there's a book for later, I suppose. Alright, well, time to play portals. <laughs> okay, so that's something. There's a lot of portals, actually. This is like the portal level. <laughs> I do love that they reuse the same late motif for all the dungeons. Get back here, gold mouse. I don't know if there's anything to do with these carpets. It doesn't really look like it. You never know if there's gonna be something that you need to do with the dark light. But yeah, Brothership was freaking fantastic. I really loved that game. <laughs> I know a lot, some people don't really care for it, but that's just bound to happen with any game, really. But personally, I freaking loved it. I might, I might actually make, I might actually say it's my second favorite now. But I don't know. Only time will tell. Whoops. <laughs> I need to, I need to stop getting hit so much. All right, come over here. I cannot dodge that. <laughs> and why don't let them both come to me then? Or just one of them. Hey, what's up, buddy? Well, he got like frozen in place. <laughs> and now I desperately need, um, now I desperately need hearts. <laughs> Well, either way, I don't think, um, personally, I don't think Brothership deserves the hate. <laughs> I think it's pretty good. <laughs> but I can see why, you know, some people not, why not like it. There's always going to be someone who doesn't like the new games. <laughs> Alright, we got another portal here. I haven't seen one of these flowers in a while. Oh, that's like a sprain to get back up. Yeah, so I mean, I've been pretty busy, obviously, playing Brothership that I haven't really focused on this game much, and it's a rare case where, um, it's where, it's where I don't, um, finish the games that I start in Spooky Month. <laughs> Which I know, freaking despicable, right? Not finishing games in the month that I'm supposed to beat them in. That's kind of why I stopped uh, caring about, like, you know, finishing games in October. <laughs> oh boy. I'll be coming to that room some point. Uh, yeah, there's no, there's no rush to play this game, though. Hello? 
Just kind of, uh, you know, take in the surroundings of the mansion and enjoy. But I will say, I keep saying time and time again, I think, um, Kevin's performance in Brothership is probably his best yet. <laughs> that is his best, uh, Mario and Luigi so far. Something tells me I'm supposed to bring something from, uh, the blue room. Or not the blue. Why do I call it the blue room? Uh, something tells me I'm supposed to do something with this portal here. I don't know, maybe there's a book in here that I'm missing. Or a log. Oh yeah, I can bring one of the logs with me. And then I can, uh, I can probably shoot it at the, uh, this guy. Yep. Yeah, you want you want my log? Well, I'm supposed to do something with this log. I don't know what exactly. Uh, I guess I can go in here for now. I kind of forgot I can go in here. <laughs> oh, I really needed that actually. <laughs> I really appreciate it. Here's the thing. I feel like most games that I play start out slow. So honestly, I don't mind really care that Brothership started out slow, because most games I play have a slow start anyways. Bro, he's taking a dump. This <laughs> This is the most relatable ghost in the game so far. He just, he, just, he just wants to take, he just wants to use the loo, man. Just let him use the loo. Oh, and I got a heart back, too. Nice. Is there some other guy using the loo? Oh, there's money. Probably a guy in the sink or something. Or there's, or could there be, there could be money up here. Hello, anybody home? Hello? Anybody else using the loo? Hmm. I feel like I'm missing something here. Or maybe, maybe not, you never know. Maybe there's just nothing to do here. I could always come back to this later. We got a door over here. This 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 is probably the most open-ended mission so far. At least that's what it feels like. Hello? Luigi, the pixel of your screen must be somewhere above you. To bring the toad back, you'll need to figure out how to reach it. Well, I would if I knew how to get to the toad, but I don't have any way to burn that Venus guy. Venus fuckboy. <laughs> yeah, give me the moon knee from the bush. I love that you can just like, you know, vacuum the environment. And there is a camera here, so that means this is probably where we're going to start future missions. That's pretty nice. Hello? No? You can't do anything with that? Well, I mean, it's not walked off, so... We got another door here. Wow. I guess, uh, someone threw everything, including a kitchen sink, <laughs> in here. You know, why, why is that a saying, anyway? <laughs> why is it always everything but the kitchen sink? <laughs> Can I put this on the stove? Oh. Nothing in there. 
Well, there's a heart. Uh, there's this. Uh, I just feel like something is missing here. Can I like, can I like dry the chicken by putting it in the water? I can burn this guy. Here, you want some chicken? There you go. Ha uh ha. -huh. That's what you get for eating burning chicken. <laughs> now, is there anything I can actually do here? Is, is, is there nothing here? It's just you burn him and you get money? Kind of funny. Yeah, I guess we ain't fixing that sink, are we? I don't think there's anything else in this. Oh wait, never mind, never mind. There is something. I knew something was missing from this room. It's a warp. All right, I got a root for this already. Oh come on! Don't fuck me over now. Jeez, the, the ice controls almost screwed me over, dude. <laughs> Yay! Give me all that money. Didn't one of these give me a gem before? I'm pretty sure that can happen. I like how the fridge was a frickin' like, secret zone. Hello? That's a fake door, obviously. Um, so this takes me back here. Bro, who, who's the jackass? Who's the jackass pushing that? Oh. Found another secret cabinet. Gold guy! Get over here, bitch. Kinda of weird that the gold guys, they don't get music. This is as atmospheric as Luigi's Mansion 2 is gonna get. <laughs> Where's that blue book at? Gotta be a blue book. Oh, wait, hang on a minute. I gotta take this with me, don't I? Well, where can I get water at? Hmm. Well, obviously, something. I could do something with this. Is there, is there any place that I could find water at? Oh, like right here. Okay, okay. Now we can water this. Hell yeah, look at that. Me, look at me being smart. Okay, and that's how we get this. And that's how we can kill, um... Can kill Mr. Mr. McMr. Venison over here. Alright, let's free Todd. Green Todd. <laughs> Find and rescue the Toad Assistant. Ah, finally fresh air! Oh, Luigi, boy am I glad to see you! It was terrible. Who's were chasing me all over the place, and that laughter, that horrible laughter. Anyways, thank you for rescuing me. My friend got captured too. We've got to save him. Huh? The professor didn't tell you there were two of us? I don't know why I'm surprised. He always thinks we're the same person. I wonder if he's colorblind. That <laughs> Luke moment right there. Luigi, let's go save my friend. Before I fainted, I overheard the booze saying their boss finished trapping inside a painting. And they muttered something about the Ice Age exhibit. Come on. Yeah, come on. Rescue the Toad in the Ice Age exhibit. Yeet. Okay, well, how can Toad help me? That's a good question. Um. Well, there's something in here. 
Spooky guy. Hang on, I'm working over here. I'm working over here. Hey, Luigi, I was talking to you. Come on, man, get over here. That's where that goon came from. Is there anything in this, in the bathroom now? Yeah, in the bathroom, Toad. Ooh, turns out there's no guy, there's nothing in here. Yeet. I love this game because you can abuse the toads. That automatically makes it a better game. <laughs> Come on. I don't think there's anything in there. Okay, well, let's try going over here then. Huh? Well, hang on a sec. Money! I haven't been finding any gems recently. Am I, am I just bad at that or what? The eyes. Oh, look at that. I probably missed something already. <laughs> it's like when Guru Larry is like, I'll be missing you already. And there goes there goes Toad freaking the fuck out again. Okay, so how does this help me exactly? Hmm. Definitely something suspicious here. What does this do? Oh wait, hang on. Free heart. And a portal. Makes sense we'd have some mummies here. That honestly doesn't surprise me. <laughs> we got a lot fight a lot of mummies actually. Okay. Well hang on, I know how to deal with all these guys. <laughs> oh, I jumped right into those guys. Alright, come here. Oh. Oh shit. Oh shit, I'm burning all of them. Okay, I just got trapped in that corner. That was annoying. Okay, so all those dumbasses, they just got, uh, they just got stuck. Bro, how did I only get one of those bastards? Alright, come here, come here. I got two of them. Okay. Oh, stupid fucking bug, bro. Alright, come here. I'll take two. Two guys is better than one guy. One big guy. <laughs> Man, I made money for days. Well, we freed the Todd. Hmm. Wait, what? <laughs> Why'd he warp? <laughs> Why'd he warp, bro? That was weird. Okay, so now I have a warp, uh... Back to the entrance? Ah, okay. Nice. Alright, so now we're in like a desert place. Oh. 
Oh, I gotta bring the water bucket here. I see. I can't fall down here. Alright, that shouldn't be too bad. I know how to get here. Now, the question is, is the bucket still in that room that I was in? Or is it back at the spawn? <laughs> That's what I'm not sure about. I guess I'll find out. There's a lot of freaking portals in this level, though. I love how canonically Toads just make squeaky noises when they walk. <laughs> That's been a thing since the Super Show. Okay, um, it is not here. It is actually where I left it. Okay. I wasn't sure, but now I know, I guess. Come on. Come on, Toad, we gotta go. We gotta go gotta put the bucket back. Oh, it's still full of water, too. Nice. Alright. Well. <laughs> Come on, I got, a, I got a bucket full of water. <laughs> if you fuck up, Toad, I'm splashing with all this water. Got the flash. Dang, I didn't know the flash was in this game. That's crazy. Alright. I don't know if I'm gonna accidentally spill all the water out. Probably not. It's just like a visual effect. That'd be funny though if you eventually splash it too much and all the water falls out. Alright. And that gives me a diamond. Oh. Wow, I, I missed a lot of diamonds, actually. <laughs> hey, you know what? I'm carrying this back. Because I'm not coming back for this later. Chances are I'm probably going to need this again. So, just to not have to repeat shit, I'm bringing this with me. I'm bringing this back to the entrance. I don't know if there's anything else down here, though. This is a very good mission so far. Hello, is there anything? Is there anything upstairs? I mean, besides these portals, I don't think there's anything up here yet. Come on. Hmm. Well, where have I been? Oh, okay. I see where I'm supposed. To. I'm supposed to get in there somehow, but I don't know how. Well, I've been everywhere so far, I think. I'm just wondering if, like, there's anything Toad can help me with. <laughs> can I do anything with Toad? I don't know. I can feed him to the Venus flytraps. bugging me right now is I don't know where that blue book is at. Hmm. Do these guys do anything? Oh, well, there's a heart. That's something. Anything here? Funny armor dudes. <laughs> uh, I mean, maybe there's a carpet I can pull. I don't know. I don't see nothing in here. I think I could just, you know, get rid of all this snow. So I think I've been everywhere so far. Yeah, more hearts. Money! Is there anything I can do with the chicken? Alright. I'm gonna go to the minus world. 
Holy shit, it's the mammoth from Totally Accurate Battle Simulator. <laughs> I can look in here. Oh, there he is. I like how this is kind of a combination of all the mansions we've been to so far. Fish. I know, really scary fish. What a, what a truly scary thing, Toad, huh? Come on. Come on. Alright, ah, Luigi's got yeeted, bro. Gargoyle roof. I don't think I don't notice that star here. Um, I'm guessing I'm supposed to shoot it. Oh, look at that. Neat. I thought this was one of the gems. I mean, maybe, maybe it is. Maybe one of the gems is here. Oh, hold on. This would be a very fitting place to have the diamond gem. Oh, well, I got a different gem. <laughs> what about the star one? Hmm. I don't think... Oh, wait, hang on. I see something here. Maybe this is where he was hiding the diamond gem at. Nope, he's got Mooney. Is there another gargoyle over here? Oh. Okay. I hope I didn't miss anything. Oh. Oh. Hello. Hello. <laughs> okay, that was cool. Come on. All right, something in this igloo maybe. Well, that opens that. There's gotta be something else here, right? Hmm. Ah, uh, okay. We'll go in here. Come on. Oh, it's 8 a it's 8 a.m. now. Now now my uh blue light is turned off. My eyes are kinda warming up. Hmm. Wait, wrong thing. Where do I need to go now? I still need to be in the in that room, but I don't know what to do in that room. Maybe bring the bucket with me. <laughs> oh wait, I have an idea. I have an idea on what I need to do actually. No, no, no. Hang on. I know. I think I. I think I figured it out. Come on. Where is those logs at? Hello? Hello? I, lo I love just going hello with Luigi. Honestly, honestly that makes up for there not being a, um... For there not being a, what you call it? Like a Mario button. <laughs> Come on. No, no, I got an idea, I got an idea. <laughs> Thing is, I don't know if this is gonna if it's gonna stay like this. I guess we'll find out. All right, I got I got the burning I got the burning wood. I mean, I think you can bring the chicken, but this just came to mind first. <laughs> and then we light the fire. Or, I guess we can't. Hello, anything here? Well, 
Well, what's the point of that? <laughs> Alright, we got two Todds now. The toads are very wholesome in this game, though. <laughs> Alright, well, now I have both toads. Hey, young feather, how's it going up there? I haven't been checking in on you because I've been nap- Uh, looking for the dark moon piece, of course. Uh, anywho, have you found that blasted toad yet? Once you do, send him through the pixelator screen in the inner courtyard. Alright. Rare case we have, oh god, fishies. The ghost fish. Whoops. I got two goons. Yeah, you're not getting away from me. <laughs> oh, the guys aren't sick of toad noises. Calm down. Alright. That'll calm them down. <laughs> Come on. See, when you want to calm toads down, you just flashbang them. <laughs> Come I, gotta, on. I gotta bring both the toads with me. Squeaky sweet. Come on. <laughs> I love how squeaky they are. That's one way you can make me like toads more. You just make them all squeaky sounding. Come on. <laughs> they brought that back for Luigi's Mansion 3 as well, which is great. I wonder if that guy taking a dump is in there again. I'd rather not find out, honestly. Alright, well, we're back here in the courtyard. Um, well, what can I do? Do I have to, uh, you know what, I probably gotta put them in the cages, don't I? Yep. And then, do that again. There's a boo! Boopa Troopa reporting for duty. The boo armies are here, so you might as well surrender. I will never surrender. Fuck. Not a good look. Hang on. How many ghosts? How many ghost fellows do you need? Alright, get over here. Game me, buddy. I'm a gingerbread man. Bro, the fucking boo got me that time. I'll worry about the boo later. Whoops. The, boo, the boo's not really my priority right now. First, let's repair this. <laughs> what is this boo doing? Why is this boo stuck? Come out, boo. Get over here. <laughs> the boos are very foony in this game. This boo seems pretty mandatory. Yeah, the boos are very fun to catch in this game. Bro had two health left. <laughs> oh, 
<laughs> Greenies are the gooners. All right, let's try that again. <laughs> I love just get any. I just love getting interrupted. Oh wow! Look at that. So that's how you get up to the next floor. No keys. No keys in that entire mission, by the way. The Toad Brothers. Luigi, I guess I wasn't paying attention to what was going on up there. When two Toads showed up here, instead of just one, I panicked. I thought a ghost had managed to sneak in with one of the Toads, so I walloped him in the nose. Oh, silly of me. He'll heal up eventually. Bro, now you're abusing your assistance? <laughs> Anywho, let me bring you back. Oh, yeah. Ega, Ega abuses his workers, confirmed. <laughs> not a good look for him. He's gonna get a hefty fine for not paying the attention to the workplace safety. <laughs> I lost a lot of health, damn. That was actually a pretty long mission, all things considered. I didn't- I kinda lost track of time. See, I knew we weren't gonna get all this mansion done in one sit- in like one day. I knew I could count on you, kiddo. You're just so dependable. Clumsy and sluggish, but dependable. Wow, thanks. But I'm one to talk. I totally forgot there were two toads in the treacherous mansion. I'm always so busy thinking about my research that I forget minor details. I got a gem. Two new gems, actually. And some goons, and a boo. And some moony. I'm glad that Toad Curators are safe and sound. Although I suppose this means I'll have to give them their paychecks now. Anywho, when I asked them, those two, about the Dark Moon piece, they had no idea what I was talking about. <laughs> yeah, just make sure, um, yeah, just don't give them one dollar per hour, otherwise everybody's gonna think you're a bad employee. Or employer, rather. <laughs> But they did not mention that there's been a lot of actions on the second floor of the Treasure's Mansion. Or they did mention. And they brought a security image with them. I wonder what secrets it'll reveal. Runner. Boo. A train to catch. <laughs> um, so out of curiosity, how many levels are in the Treacherous Mansion? Is it five? Plus the boss, or what? Luigi, there was something funky, funky, going on with the security image, but I think I fixed it. <laughs> yep, this thing is hot off the press. No other security image has been taking so recently. Let's take a gander. Wow, well, go figure. There's booze. Mario. Oh shit. <laughs> um, it's the same old bag those booze been carrying around this whole. Wait a minute. Yowza, that's your brother Mario! <laughs> How did he get captured? This is downright awful! Well, let's take a closer look. That room seems to be the train exhibit. You need to get there to rescue your brother. Mario. You can tell it's a more up-to-date Mario design, because he's got, like, the little design on his overalls that Mario Odyssey kind of has. Look at that boo. He's gonna lick the train. Mmm, tasty train. 
Looks like a miniature train model. I wonder what those hooligans are using it for. Six levels. So I could get, um, three levels done. This, <laughs> that's no regular boo. Could that be... Jump scare. <laughs> what in tarnation? King Boo, the master of illusions. He's been the one pulling the strings the whole time. And he somehow managed to capture your brother. Unbelievable. That fiend, if he thinks we're just going to sit by and... Eureka! The Periscopes found a huge signal in the train exhibit. Well, if there are six levels, then I could probably beat, um, like, E3 or E4 today, and then I could do, like, the last few levels plus King Boo at the end. You've seen in the security images, wherever King Boo goes, he takes Mario's painting with him. You've got to get to that train exhibit and rescue your brother. Perhaps Mario can help us defeat King Boo and restore the Dark Moon. <laughs> I've, gotten so I've gotten so used to saying Mario after, uh, frickin' my brothership playthrough. Here, take this makeshift rotor. It'll let you turn that huge staircase that rose from the ground. Look lively, Luigi. Your brother needs you. Yeah, like lively Lily. I am warping in the Minecraft world. Okay, it spawns us here, which is decent. Better than nothing. So we gotta go activate the stairwell in the inner courtyard. Still never found that blue book. Maybe that won't be until later. Money! Well, shit, now I gotta go check if there's something else in that room that I was in. So I guess that means those two portals on the top floor are gonna activate at some point. Huh. Yeah, I knew something was off about this. Boom. Money again! I wonder if I can, uh... I wonder if I can fuck up these knights. No, I don't think I can. I'm not sure what the point of the carpets are in this room, then. I feel like there's definitely something in this room now. There's money! That's something. I can't seem to get the money, though. I can get a few of the coins. Uh, that chest is gonna be empty. Yeah, where's that blue book gonna be at? I don't know, I guess we'll find out. Oh, right, I need to know. Is that guy taking a dump there again? <laughs> That's all I care about right now, is the guy taking a dump. Nothing. Oh wait, hang on, I can look in here. Oh, it's just this room again. Hmm. Also, I think there's another missing gargoyle here. Is there is there anything locked behind level two or higher dark light yet, I wonder? I don't think I've seen anything quite like that yet. Let's continue. Well, every mansion has a bonus level. So, I'm used to that. But we're not going to be playing those until the very end of the game, once I get all the gems and booze. Probably, like, one mansion per episode. Oh, well, this is open now. And it's got money! Oh, wait, these coins respawn too. 
And so these gold bars. Well, can't use the piss, can't use the shitter for anything. Mario? 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 Wait, I have a Mario button now. Mario. Oh, that's amazing. I got a Mario button now. Oh, that's be that's beautiful. I guess we didn't have a Mario button because we didn't know Mario was captured. That makes sense. I didn't notice that. I didn't know that. It, like the second you get to this level, the button it changes. That's a really cool attention to detail. <laughs> yeah. Although I am gonna miss Luigi saying hello. <laughs> that was like my favorite one. Hot dog. That's one nifty stairway. Now head to the train exhibit. Mm, well, first I need to see what's up here. Oh. It's it's actually broken. Dang it. Okay, so this can take me over here. Hmm. I'm going to do everything except for the place that I need to go to. <laughs> Oh, gooey guy. Those gooey guys are very weird. Get in here, gooey guy. Anything in here? Oh, that's just the rooftop again. I mean, there's probably not much I'm gonna be able to do in these rooms. Well, there's a there's some spooky guys in here. Gotcha, bitch. Spooky guy is probably somewhere in here. Oh, nice. <laughs> Haven't needed the gold bone in a while. I've been kind of slaying at these missions recently. Spooky guy. Wait, get back here, bro. Dang it. Spooky ghost music. Ghost. Alright, I don't know if this I don't know what the point of this is. But oh, there's the star. And that's the main reason I wanted to do all half these rooms, because there's probably some random shit I can get like that. I mean, I already accepted the fact that I'm probably not gonna be three-starring all these levels, but I am gonna get all the gems and all the booze. <laughs> I don't know. It, I don't know. Is it technically not 100% if I don't get all the three stars? That's the thing. I don't know. <laughs> oh. I'm guessing the ghosts are in one of these. Oh, there's a paper. <laughs> okay. Right, there's something I'm needing to be doing here, probably. I mean, I could just keep checking the same one over and over. Probably what I need to do 
is I'll need to come back here later, and I need to bring, like, something to burn these boxes or something. I don't know. <laughs> Probably. Unless there's something in this room that I haven't found. No. Okay, I won't worry about this room right now. <laughs> A missing gargoyle and a gooey guy. Get over here, man. These guys aren't really that tough. Oh yeah. Oh, I'm gonna miss all those spooters, but I guess it's okay. There is a teleporter in this room, though. Space exhibit. I'm getting familiar with all the rooms, at least. Dang, that looks pretty sick. Probably this is gonna be important later. <laughs> and the music gets all calm again, like nothing ever happened. There's a gold guy in there. Hmm. Can't get in there yet. Money! There's one coin in there. Yeah, I'm definitely going to need some fire from somewhere. Well, actually, I know where I can get fire at. Where's the where's the room with the chicken again? Actually, wait, no. You can't actually. I don't think you can use the room with the chicken. Now that I think about it. Froggies. I'm, I know. I'm, I'm going out of my way to burn this guy so I can get so I can get that gold guy. Okay, so he's up here in the space exhibit. All right. <laughs> yeah, serves him right. But he's gone now. Well, shit. Yeah, you can't go indoors with this, so that's just kind of going to be stuck in here now. So that guy will be somewhere. I don't know where. Oh, he crash landed. That's the most in-depth gold guy in the game so far. That was pretty fun, I like that. Yep, typical me, going everywhere except for the place that I need to go. What the shit? Oh, I didn't even notice that. Oh, dude, there's the blue book right there. I have to get over there somehow. And there's a pumpkin patch here. Oh. Apparently these have money in them? Oh yeah, they do. Look at that. Die, pumpkins. Give me all your money. <laughs> I'm telling pumpkins that die. 
Okay, and there's a golden balloon here that I can't get to. Unless I can. Okay, it'll take me back here. Honestly, I'm okay with that. Because I wanted to go back to the entrance anyway. Question is, how do I get up there? Well, I I flashed them. Can I get up there? I think that's why they want me to go to the train exhibit. Mario. Mario. <laughs> I like how some of these Marios are just from Luigi's Mansion 1. Like that one. <laughs> really funny hearing uh, the old Luigi's Mansion 1 voice clips. Alright, well, I don't think we need to go up on the top one. Wait, can I go on the... can I go down? Yeah, I need to know. Is there something over there? Oh, there is. There's nothing there. Okay. Push it back, then. Now we can actually go to the train exhibit like we were supposed to. <laughs> I mean, there is a pathway there. I don't. I think that takes you to the rooftop, though, which I've already went to. Who left the door open? Is this just out the rooftop again? Yeah. Well, I, mean, I think that might, might be that might be a different rooftop, actually. It looks different. I'm going to go out here. <laughs> East balcony. There's lots of froggies in there. Gold froggies, to be precise. I'm not sure how I get in there yet, but I guess we'll figure that out. I don't think there's a secret path or nothing. Not a cult exhibit. It's too frickin' foggy in here, man. I can't see shit. That doesn't seem to do anything. Can I do anything with this ship? Oh, I, I was hoping I could use that. Does the dark thing even work in here? <laughs> I don't think it does. Octopus friend. <laughs> what? That just hits? That just hurts me? <laughs> so what's the deal with this ship then? Oh. Hold up. Is there something I need to do here? Hmm. I'm not sure, honestly. 
Can I stand on one of these? Um, I'm not gonna worry about this room right now, then. Maybe, maybe something for later. Oh, there's a book. Ramp, ramp. Oh, there's uh, some balloons here. What can I do with this? Huh. Can I go in the doors with this? No, I can't. What is the point of all this? You sure there isn't anything else in here? Well, obviously I'd like to get in there, but I don't know how. Because I don't know how to get the yellow book. Wait, hang on, never mind, I see it. It's somewhere back there. Where is Luigi? Right here. Yeah, there's a book right here. But how do I get it? Ah, oh, by using the dark light, of course. The gold book! Duh. I was like, nope, no book for you. Uh, hello? No bitches? Hello? There's the no bitches hello? Luigi thing. <laughs> and that guy ran off with my freaking book. How lame. Oh, hello? Bastard ghost! The passage in the bookshelf won't open without that book he took. The periscope doesn't work well in that mansion, but I'll try to find him. Give it a second. Come on, you piece of brilliantly designed junk. Bingo. He seems to be somewhere on the floor on the west side. Mm -hmm. I know, not very precise, but better than nothing. Start searching while I keep trying. Ow. Well, it's a good thing I have experience with the west side of the mansion already. So at least I know how it works over here. Mm -hmm. Kind of a cool way to design a staircase. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Like I, I like how that two damage is still affecting me. All right, so where could he be? In here? No, I don't think he's in here. Lying on, that room, that door is locked now, so I think I have an idea on how to get to him. I can just use the teleporter. Let me try that. Um, whoops, I can't go that way. <laughs> this music's oddly calming. Yeah, because I think that I got this room open already, so... Let's hop in the space exhibit. Well, this is acting up. Okay, and how do I get in there exactly? Oh, shit, I'm here now. Bro's got 200 health.
These battles are pretty cool. <laughs> Do I need to throw a bomb at him or something? Alright, one more. The 200 HP is just a suggestion. Bugs. You ain't gonna get me with those freaking bombs, bro. Hey, man, I'm getting some money for all my hard work. the gold bars. <laughs> They're gone. Rip my gold bars, dude. Wait, so how do I get back there? Do I have to bring this book all the way there? Yeah, that's a problem. I can't go in through the doors with this. Hmm. Is there something I need to do here? Hmm. Yeah, I'm not sure. <laughs> oh, there's a heart there. Okay, this is a problem. How can I carry this gold? How can I carry this frickin' gold, um... This gold thing over there. I think maybe this is where the nautical exhibit comes into play. I mean, obviously I'm supposed to go here. Hmm. I'll, I'll come back for the book later. I gotta figure out how to get it to there, though. I think I might take a break after this level, and then uh, I'll see if I feel like doing one more level, maybe. I'm not sure, though. It's been almost an hour and a half already. <laughs> And well, I'm not in a rush to finish this game either. Is there anything new in this room that I can do? in this room still. This doesn't seem to be doing anything still. And the octopus is not doing anything either. I don't know, maybe there's something I gotta do in this room first. Uh, I'm so confused what I need to do here. I can't bring this with me. Hmm. There's a bunch of bat there's a bunch of rats everywhere. Well these rats weren't here before. Hmm. Okay. 
Okay, I get it. I get that. There's gotta be something I can do with that book. I'll figure that out in a little bit. Well, uh, I never went to the to the back room. <laughs> the back room. Yeah, what if I try going up there? I don't think I don't know if there's anything up here, but I'll check. Yeah, I can clearly go up here. This is the terrace, not the gargoyle roof. So, I mean, maybe this will do something. I mean, honestly, I don't even know if there's anything given up here besides these pumpkins. This is probably all that's actually up here right now. Yeah, I think so. I think that there's nothing up here right now. This seems like a very important spot, though, that I'll need to remember for later. Yeah. Well, shit, where do I go, then? It's not like I can use this. Uh -uh. <laughs> See, it's, it's, just, it's times like this where I wish you could just call EGAD up and say like, Hey, can I have like a hint or something? But no, you can't do that. You gotta figure out everything on your own. I don't think you can call EGAD on your own in any of the games anyway. Well, I mean... Obviously, I can bring this with me into any of the other portals. So, I mean, maybe there's something I need to do with this one. I can bring it to any one of these four rooms. Like this room. <laughs> So this doesn't help me in any way. Is there anything I can do with this frickin' book? Cause I don't know how to get it back to the rooftop. Or I don't know how to get it to that room that I want to be in. Like, obviously I want it to be able to go into that portal, but I can't. Can I use this for anything? No, this just shows this again. Oh boy, might have hit a second roadblock, honestly. Uh, what about in here? Anything in here? There's money here. That's something. <laughs> yeah, I don't know, honestly. I don't know where I'm supposed to go. I really wish I could just... <laughs> things would be so much easier if I could just carry things in through doors, but you can't. <laughs> Obviously, it's not in here. Yeah, I might have to look up what to do, because I don't freaking know. I mean, I might- otherwise, I should just brute force it in that room again. Ah, uh, fuck it, I'll give it another try. Let me see what I- let me see if there's anything else I can do in that freaking room. There's a 
hidden door here. I never found this. Oh, there's just a second bathroom in here that I never found. Oh. Well, I, mean, I found something at least. <laughs> I found something of worth. So not all is lost. Found something good with during my backtrack. <laughs> well, I'll, yeah, I'll look. I watch Chuck Conroy's Let's Play. Yeah, definitely. <laughs> I don't know who. I, I guess. I guess someone was having a kidney stone that day. <laughs> I'm gonna keep- I'm gonna keep brute forcing my way through that room. I'm gonna see if I can find out anything. Otherwise, yeah, I might have to look at the guide. I- I don't know. I watched Zack Scott games last time. I wanted to figure out where to go. <laughs> Only had to watch like 30 seconds to get the idea. But like, I- I understand that I'm probably supposed to do something in this room. I also noticed there's like a hidden path. There's like a hidden- door over here? Hmm. Oh, hang on, there's a door over there. So maybe I need to... Maybe I need to grab something in this room and put it on the switch. Like, maybe this thing? Well, every time I try to flash this guy, he doesn't seem to notice me. Hmm. Hmm. Is there anything I can grab in this room? Can I grab the octopus? Nope. I get the feeling I'm supposed to do something in this room, but I don't know what. Hmm. Can't do anything with this guy, still. Won't let me flash this. Oh, wait, wait, I did something. Why did I hear the harp noise? Okay, I, somehow I figured out what to do. <laughs> I don't know what I just did, but I clearly figured it out. Ah, okay. Lol. Nice try, goons. Was that something with having to blow? I don't know. Hmm. I flashed something. Okay, I don't know what I did, but whatever. I'm glad I figured it out without having to look it up. <laughs> Alright, well that's another point for me and one less for Luigi's Mansion 2, I suppose. So does this do anything, by the way? Oh, wait. Oh yeah. That's what I'm supposed to do. Oh, that makes sense now. That's why that was there. Okay, so now what I can do is I can grab that book that I left in the lobby. So we can actually bring it there. Well, that, 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 uh, was tough. I figured that out, though, on my own. Didn't have to look up Zat Scott games again. Um, also, I have, I have an idea on what I want to do in that room. Real quick, before I progress, there's something that I want to do. 
I want to put, I want to switch the, uh, I want to switch the wheel back in here. And I want to bring a log into that room. I mean, it, it can be a log, it can be a buck, I don't think it really matters too much. Either of them work. Next level is a boss. I guess we'll see. <laughs> Come on, chat member. You don't think I've been watching Chug Conroy's Bowser's Anti Story playthrough? <laughs> Alright, so I'm gonna assume I can put this here. Yep, there we go. So here's a secret. A very well hidden secret, I might add. Yeah, there you go. Okay. Glad I figured that one out myself. There's probably something to do with that blue book in the entrance, but I don't know. So now we can go to the train. I like trains. Oh, yeah, there are definitely trains in here. And there's a spooky guy. Big spooky guy. Ah, so that's how you want to play, buddy. Oh, I almost got both of them at the same time. Oh, wait, I did. Never mind, I didn't. Why can't I just have my happy ending? And attack both these goons at the same time. Alright, come on, bro. Wait, I saw another goon over here. It's gonna be really annoying to capture both these guys when they're shooting spitballs at me. Get back here, bro. They sure love their hiding spots. The boos are playing with the terrain. More probably, how are they doing that? Boo jump scare. <laughs> oh. Hello. Luigi, dude, what did you see? Any signs of Mario? Criminy, you must be wondering how he got inside there, eh? Don't you worry, I've got an idea of percolating. <laughs> I'm bringing you back. Hold on tight. Ow. Get to the train exhibit. Man, I did it. 39 minutes for that level. Man, these levels are long. At least I got a silver that time. If the next level is actually the boss then hey, we'd be done. Otherwise, uh, I'll probably save it for next episode. We'll see. I have far from all the gems, though, so we'll see. Chin up, young fella. We'll get your brother back. Although I imagine his painting would fetch a pretty penny at an art auction. Heh, <laughs> just kidding, my boy. All right, well, we got more gems. Three new gems. Look at all those goons I'm getting. I wonder what you get, 20k. Now, did you have to see that tiny camera inside the miniature model of the train exhibit? I might be able to route the pixelator to it and send you in. 
Of course, it's incredibly dangerous. I've never tried pixeling anything with such a small camera. But it's as they say, fortune favors the old. And I'm not as young as I used to be. <laughs> a train. Oh, yeah, yeah, we are at the boss. Damn, why are these mansions so short now? <laughs> Get in there, defeat King Boo and rescue Mario? That doesn't seem right. Oh, hey there, Luigi. Well, it wasn't easy, but I got it done. I managed to route the pixelator to the mini camera inside of that train exhibit. And the periscope is still picking up a huge paranormal signal. It's gotta be King Boo. Maybe there's two bosses in this dungeon, I don't know. The signal isn't moving, so I suspect he's up to something major and probably evil in there. Which makes it the perfect time for us to strike. If we can surprise him, he won't have time to react. And with the mini camera right there, you'll never see it coming. Hey, you ready, son? This is it. This is it, Luigi. Get in there, rescue Mario, and while you're at it, capture King Boo. This is a golden opportunity. Good luck, Luigi. Three bosses. <laughs> That's a lot. Well, I'll do this boss and call it a day, then I think what I'm thinking. Yeah, we are definitely inside the train exhibit. Don't know if there's anything I can do with these trains. Besides making, like, the main important part of the train spawn in. <laughs> I love how they design circles in this game. It's always full of hexagons. Hey, looking for someone? Boo. Boo losses? <laughs> I may not be the king, but I sure am big. Big enough to crush you. It's not Boo losses. Probably need to push the boo into the train somehow. Like that, yeah. <laughs> oh, well, that's a, that's a cool boss. to like actually knock him into the train though don't i hmm. okay I, I know how to do this now boom boom Oh, dang. Hard to say if this is really fitting boss music or not. Bruh. Can I just hold him in place and let him get run over by the train? I guess not. Alright, get run over. Far. How'd I get him the first time, bro? 
Am I dumb? Oh, I gotta launch him into the train. Okay, I think I understand this. Maybe. <laughs> That's funny. Big boo. I would like to have your big boos. Okay, I didn't launch him far enough, apparently. Bro, am I stupid? Oh, I'm not pressing A. Wow, how am I so bad at this boss, bro? <laughs> there we go. Well, you gotta knock the boo into the train first. Alright, knock the boo into the train this time. Oh, you gotta, like, actually time it, too. Oh, shit. I got one of them, at least. <laughs> Alright, I understand this boss now. Whoops, too early. <laughs> um, well, I didn't quite get all of them. Another one? I got like two boos per cycle, I guess. <laughs> oh he's got a new pa he's got a new pattern now. Oh, I didn't quite knock him into the front of the train. <laughs> get multiple boos at once. I didn't know that. Okay. Oh, that's gonna be the hardest part, though, is trying to get all the boos into the, like, back train. Oh, wow. What a dumbass. There's four boo four booze left. All right, there's another one. All right, we got another one coming over here. Oh, I missed, dude. I missed one boo! Oh, he's doing it again. Yeah, 
There you go. All right, I got this. All right, I got you, boo. Da dang it. He's gonna be, he's gonna be a tough guy to get. All right, launch him in this time. Whoop, yeet. There we go. I freed you guys. Well, I guess I could, you could say I freed them. <laughs> oh, hello. Luigi, that was definitely not King Boo. We tried to ambush him, but we ended up getting ambushed ourselves. But you seem to be fine. Nice work, son. No sign of Mario, eh? Don't you worry, we'll find him. Hold on, I'll try to get you out of there. I think that's a pretty good note to end the episode on, honestly. <laughs> With a boss fight against Boo Lossus. Play Luigi dance. <laughs> that is pretty good. That's about on par with the with the other Boo losses fight in the first game. I mean, that might not be big. That might not be Boo losses. I think it's a different Boo, more like a more generic Boo. But whatever. That's Boo losses in my book. <laughs> Well, let's see what the wiki thinks. <laughs> let's see. Let's see if the wiki agrees with me. Let's see. Um, it says although Boolossus does not appear, a big boo comprised of ten regular boos appears in the treacherous mansion. Um, it is similarly fought by spitting, splitting it back up. In the Japanese version, it shares the name Jumbo Teresa, which is the same name as Bulossus. So it kind of is Bulossus. <laughs> well, if they have the same name, then in Japanese, then that basically is Bulossus. Whatever. Luigi, okay, youngster? Phew. Yeah. Oh. I know Boo Loss is annoying, but there's something really charming about how annoying that fight is. No money! I can't believe King Boo pulled a fast one on us like that. I should have known. He probably staged the security image to lure you there. It's just like I told you, eh, Luigi? Gay Luigi? Boos always spell trouble, especially when they gang up. But those boos won't be bothering us anytime soon. They were still trapped in that train when I brought you back. But I made a quick tweak to the pixelator and sent them all down to the vault. Heh, <laughs> suckers. Well, I'm looking at the treacherous mansion real quick. <laughs> but King Boo's still out there, and this won't end well until we defeat him. I wonder how he escaped from his portrait in the first place. Maybe I shouldn't have sold it at that garage sale. You dumbass. Heh, <laughs> anywho. Take a breather, young feller, but make it quick. Your brother's counting on you. Well, let's look at the treacherous mansion. <gasps> um, there's E4, which we just did. E5, E6, and the bonus. So we're actually getting pretty close to finishing this game. Oh yeah, apparently that counts as E4. That's not actually the boss. <laughs> so yeah, there's going to be E5 in the boss, and then we're done with the Treacherous Mansion, it looks like. Okay, and then we will uh, be able to fight King Boo. But I'm going to probably save King Boo for um, a pretty long time. <laughs> E6 has two bosses. Dang. Is that because you have to fight, um, King Boo, or what? Actually, I think King Boo is his own level. <laughs> I think. Yeah. Well, anyways. 
Um, oh, King Boo's the second boss. I think you, you can only fight King Boo in like his own level, though. I mean, that that that, see, that would make sense to me at least. <laughs> I don't know. Well, we'll probably. I don't know. Here's the thing. I'm not sure if I should fight King Boo before getting all the ghosts or all the boos and the gems is what I'm not sure about. Because I feel like it would be kind of anticlimactic if I, I beat King Boo and then I do like a shit ton of episodes where I just get gems and boos and stuff. And then like, you know, once I get all of them, it's just the game's over, you know. I feel like it would be more satisfying if I went back to get all of them. When you beat King Boo, you can challenge him anytime he wants. Oh. I think I'll just save the final level for its own episode, probably. Yeah. Well, anyways, uh, I think that'll do it for today. Um, I wasn't expecting that to take so long. I guess we got three levels done. That's not too bad. So I'll, I'll I say it's a pretty... As long as I get, like, three levels done per episode, I think that's pretty good. <laughs> But anyways, we will do uh, E5 next episode, and then we'll start go, uh, doing our backtrack uh, throughout um, Gloomy Manor. And that's where we're going to start getting all the gems and boos, and I'm going to have to probably use a guide for that, because I don't know where everything is. So, yeah. Uh, make sure to like and subscribe to YouTube and Twitch, guys. And um, maybe expect the Silent Hill 2 stream today. Uh, it depends if Jose's busy or not, because he said he wanted to do it today, but for all I know, he's fucking busy again, or his parents want him to go out or something, I don't know. We'll see. But, uh, I'll see you guys then.